we have a normal chest x-ray in front of us and I want you to pay attention to the orientation of ribs and notice how posterior ribs are visible on a chest x-ray and how anterior ribs are visible on, the, on a chest x-ray so these are posterior ribs all of them so this is a posterior rib this is a posterior rib this is a posterior rib they all can be traced laterally and then they move forward to become anterior ribs so these are frontal ribs and they're all sort of pointing towards the midline towards the sternum of the patient I want to show you another x-ray and we have seen this x-ray before and last time we paid attention to this uh, semi-circular ring in the area of mitral valve and we also found out that this was actually a calcification in mitral valve itself we also learned that this patient has some old healed rib fractures but if you pay attention to the anterior ribs they're all pointing downwards towards the uh, patient's feet all of them so they cannot be traced in this direction they, so these are posterior ribs and they all are moving down so what could be the reason of such orientation of anterior ribs well this is a typical picture if a patient has kyphosis which means hunchback or a bowing of his spine in simple English although it would be wonderful to have a lateral view to see the degree of kyphosis or even to confirm what we have just said but at least you can uh, diagnose kyphosis even without one this kyphosis is most probably age related this is an old patient 72 years old patient he has calcification in the mitral valve some calcification in arch of aorta if you look at the lung parenchyma if you go back this is uh, a healthy young lung parenchyma that's how it looks like well this parenchyma is normal for age but that's uh, how you can differentiate between an old patient and a young patient thank you very much